Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Classic Who reaction. We are on to the Time Monster Part 6. We're at the end guys, I know a lot of you will be really happy that we're at the end. After the last episode, I'm happy I'm at the end. But overall I have enjoyed this story. I just found myself a little bit lost in the last episode. So, my prediction is the Master is going to escape. Joe has now been put in with that big beast. We don't know what the beast is. It could be something that Joe could sweet talk. It could actually be like a nice, a nice creature that just needs, you know, like in um, like the Peladon one. The creature was actually quite nice. I assume the doctor's going to come to the rescue. I don't know what's going to happen with the crystal. Haven't got a blinking clue. Right, let's go. God, did you see those muscles? Lord King, forgive me. Tell us time. Wow. Just seduce him or something. Stay back. Ah. Ah. The master's going to appear. There you are, Joe. That's what all the fuss has been about. It's beautiful. But at the same time, horrible. It gives me a funny feeling. Well, cheer up, Joe. Now that we've found the crystal... Benton gives me a funny feeling. Game is at an end. Not quite. The game is just beginning. Why nothing? Then he's still alive? Why, certainly. And treated honorably. Even though Dalius is an old man. I love her outfits. And now it appears that I have to thank you both. What for? For giving me the crystal. You don't want to say that you still in Tomorrow to you will both receive a suitable reward. Carry out my commands without question like a soldier. You mean like a servant girl? <sighs> and you must learn my love. That Galea is a queen. Yes, queen. I demand to be taken to the Lady Galea. You'll do as you're told. How dare you lay your hands on me? I shall see the Queen. Out of my way, slave! <laughs> my sweet Queen. Is the Master responsible for this? Aye. Uh, uh, but it is no matter. Come close. And you are the one to do it. The only one. Who would have thought it, my lovely Khalil? Oh, he's, he's dead. I shall present to you His Holiness, the most venerable Lord Master. Absolutely. Silence! Silence! You promised he should not be harmed. He was an old man, and he was stubborn. <laughs> Seize him! Seize him! What is the switch? No, stop him! Stop him! Kronos! I, the master, will 
I think we've seen the last of the doctor. Buried for all time under the ruins of Atlantis. <laughs> you know, I'm going to miss him. He's not finished. I just know it. Oh, you know, that was worthy of the late lamented doctor himself. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I could keep myself for not having polished him off long ago. <laughs> just think of the oh, and Joe. Escape. Dominion over all time and all space. Absolute power forever. And no doctor to ruin things for me. <laughs> Don't worry, Joe. Doctor! I'll soon sort him out for you. Doctor! <laughs> Extinction. Total annihilation. For you, the TARDIS, and the Crystal. And for you and Miss Grant. Oh, yes, of course. But by then, Kronos will be free. And the universe will be saved. You will? Go ahead. Goodbye, Joe. I was just about to do it myself. Oh, really? Now, look, Joe. <laughs> no, not really. <clears throat> Greetings. <laughs> Your courtesy is always so punctilious, Doctor. I am Grimace. You? Eh? But you're a girl. The shapes mean nothing. No! Doctor, please. Please help me. I can't bear it. Please, Doctor, please. Marty Kronos, may I ask one last favor of you? No. His life. His freedom. He made a prisoner of me. Condemn anybody to an eternity of torment, even the master? Yes. No, I guess I wouldn't. No. Well, neither would I. Even though he was responsible for the destruction of Atlantis. Do hey, Yes, it is. Good. Seems to be working a bit too well. It's running away again. Everybody get down. It's gonna go up. Where's the master? A very good question, Brigadier. Doctor, glad to see you're back. Sprout, 
What on earth are you doing in that extraordinary get <laughs> And where, for heaven's sake, is Sergeant Benson? The baby. We forgot the baby. Would somebody please mind telling me exactly what's happening around here? <laughs> Sergeant Benton naked, I'll look after him. I volunteer as tribute. So that episode definitely picked up. I, the Kronos thing at the end was weird, that Kronos was then a woman. The Masters escaped, obviously I predicted that. Um, it was definitely a strange story and I did enjoy it. I wouldn't say I loved it. There were aspects, the first three, maybe the first four episodes, I actually really, really enjoyed. Um, six part of that, it was way too long, way too long. I'm going to give that a seven. Just straight up seven. I think that's a fair score. We had some great moments with some of the characters, so... That also helps with the score. So yes, that's done. That was the last one of season nine. Wait, what? It was, wasn't it? Okay. So the next episode, I have been told again and again not to look at the story title. I haven't looked at the title. Um, so that's exciting. I'm going to watch it now, the first one. I'm nervous. Um, yes there's also going to be a couple of extra things going on my patreon to do with the next episode so yes I'll talk about that in like five minutes but to you you're not going to see it till Sunday yeah you're not going to see it till Sunday um but the next episode I will be doing my first ever full-length reaction of on my patreon a few of you couple of well a couple of my patrons have requested it and that's what I'm going to do even though I don't know what the story title is I'm doing a full length to it so if you if you are at all interested um all of the details are below right I'm going to go now I uh, hope you have a lovely weekend and I will see you on Sunday for the opener of series 10